Hey guys, welcome to the Amazing Spider-Man gameplay. Now, I don't know how long I left the menu open, but I was using the bathroom at the time, so don't blame me why we have to stare at this menu for a while. But, so far, what I thought of the game, pretty good. You know, it's Spider-Man, because you gotta go Spider-Man, Spider-Man. Goes everywhere, because he's a Spider-Man. Uh, I like the graphics so far. Um, story sounds compelling. I, I heard it's a really good game. But uh, let me decide that for myself. There isn't going to be any audio on this because, you know, I want to talk. So listen to my voice. Listen to my voice. Oh, yes, because it's so attractive. So when do I press start? When do I actually come back? Because I just left it on for how however long. But, yeah, I'm, I'm interested in how this compared to the movie. And so far, so good. Oh, here we go. Uh, yeah, Oscorp. How... Runaway train, runaway train. Oh, hello, I'm a stone. How are you doing? Oh, she's gonna pull away. Good thing I rough subtitles. Can you know what they're saying? So, too bad if you can't hear the game, what not. So, how, how, how are you doing, Emma Stone? Because I'm Andrew Garfield, and you know, you want to get all over me. Oh, I, I, I kind of like the story how it goes off the movie since I already saw the movie, and yeah, the movie was good. Check out my review for that. Oh, you should. Ho, ho, ho. Uh, <laughs> what am I saying? Come on. Oh, Dr. Connors. Oh, yeah, he got... Don't, don't use Dr. Connors' work. He's a mad guy. He used it on himself. So, yeah, there there are spoilers. There are spoilers about the, about the movie in here. So, if you have not seen the movie, which you should have had last week, so... We're just going to follow Emma Stone for a while. Dr. Smite. Let's follow Emma Stone for a while, see what's happening. I don't know why you don't get the look of Peter Parker's face. He could have done it a little bit in third-person mode. They could have taken advantage of that. I don't know. It's just a nitpick, I guess, so far. So, what do we want to talk about? Let's see. Let's talk about other games. Uh, or other movies, in fact. Uh, let's see. Uh, the Amazing Spider-Man movie, it's uh, actually done really good so far. Uh, 140 million all week so far it's made like the weekend it made only 65 million which is okay I guess you know for a Marvel movie actually a superhero movie in general that it's kind of good I guess in a way but you never know hey how you doing there robot <laughs> wait I'm supposed to be looking at Emma Stone because she's the hottest thing ever <laughs> oh shit what oh it's Rhino shit you can tell by his horn Hello. I thought Rhino was just a freak on a costume. Oh, oh shit. Oh shit, watch out. Oh, this. <laughs> okay, well. Oh shit. Uh, hello. Alistair. Aren't you supposed to be in a wheelchair? Working for the Kingpin? I I've been watching too much of the animated cartoon show. <laughs> but, um, yeah, Spider Man, um, how it's doing in the box office. It's surprising well. 140 million. The movie was like 135 million to uh, work with. I heard, but I could be completely wrong. Does it deserve to have more money? Yeah, I could say so. It does, but does it deserve to have less? No, I think it's fine right now where it is. It did, of course, it doesn't have to make as much as the Avengers, but you know, Avengers, Avengers, no problem with that. <laughs> Again, Avengers was better in my opinion. If we see Spider-Man in Avengers 2, I wouldn't be surprised because now that <laughs> now that Sony's seen how much money that the Avengers made, huh, do we want to put our character in a movie that makes money? More money than we did? Because hmm. I think that would be the dumb idea, right? You know, oh, putting a character in the movie, it's not, no one's going to notice him at all. You know, it's just Spider-Man or anything, one of, our, one of the most iconic superheroes in the world. Like, to me, there are two iconic icons, well, one icon from each company, two in just all superhero genre. There's Batman, and then there's Spider-Man, okay? At the time... Spider-Man was the biggest for Marvel, and then Batman was the biggest for DC. Batman's always been the big biggest for DC. I don't know why it wouldn't he would never be, but Batman is just a MILF. Let's just get that out of the way. Of course, you gotta thank Chris Nolan for making him the bigger biggest MILF in the world. He was always a MILF. The comics he was always a MILF. <laughs> 
You guys are probably wondering, why am I calling Batman a MILF? And you know what? I'm not going to tell you. I don't need to tell you. So shut the fuck up. But yeah, Batman, he was basically really cool and really awesome at the same time. So don't judge me for what I have to say about Batman. And Spider-Man... Spider-Man's been always all over the place, okay? The 60s he came out, he was one of the biggest hits of all time. Thanks to Stan Lee. Praise that man, give him... I, I pray him. Um, but when Spider-Man came out, you know, he was a big hit. What can you say? People thought, oh man, he's just a nerd who turns into a superhero. I wish that could be me, because he was relatable, you know? He had relatable problems, as most people did. As most people who read comics did. <laughs> I'm not trying to say people who read comics are nerds. I'd be calling myself a nerd, but then again, I could call myself a nerd. <laughs> but I don't know why. I don't know. It's kind of weird when you think about how Avengers made lots more money. Is it because the Iron Man, the original Iron Man when it came out, was just so successful that when the Avengers were going to come out, that they knew the movie was going to be super successful? You know... I don't know if Marvel had this plan all along since like 2004 or something. Like after Spider-Man 2 came out, I was like, let's release more heroes, you know. Let's just get, you know, Captain America and Thor and Iron Man out there. It's kind of interesting how you're talking about it. Oh, what? Uh, oh, hey, unpredictable. What? <laughs> but yeah. Hey, his, Peter Parker was thinking the same thing as me. Oh, shit, look. It's a tube. <laughs> I know what's in the tube. I know, because I already played this. <clears throat> Speaking of which, you wish to add me on Xbox Live, you can. Uh, all you have to do is message me on Xbox Live. Uh, Laughing Tree 2013, in all caps, you can do that. Or you can... um. Or you can just do that. <laughs> I don't know why I thought there was another way to add me on Xbox, but okay. Oh, hey, go back in your wheelchair. Get out of here. Oh, don't tell my girlfriend what to do, bitch. I'll get all over your ass. <laughs> I can't believe that actually. I think I got on the mic. <laughs> but like I was saying, I don't know if my... Oh, shit, it's Scorpion. Wait, I knew that. <laughs> I, I don't know why they... Oh. I knew Scorpion was a mutation, like that they worked with, but I didn't know. I didn't know they worked with like this. Like Rhino, I don't understand at all. Huh? He's going fucking crazy in there. <laughs> I'm wondering what villain they're gonna make for the next Spider-Man, because if they're gonna include Mary Jane in the next one, they have to kill off Gwen Stacy. So we have to put Goblin in there. But if we're not, then when we get to choose? Hmm. Are we going to choose, you know, Scorpion? As a matter of fact, is he beating on the freaking glass? Are we going to choose Rhino, who we already saw? Are we going to see the lizard again break out of jail? Not to spoil anything, if he does. Oh, excuse me, sinuses. <laughs> I gotta have, like, a cold in the summer. <laughs> I hate that. Oh, shit, Gwen! Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Look at that asshole. Oh, shit, I left my Xbox, huh? <laughs> okay. What else are we looking at? I don't even know if this is picking up. Honestly, half the conversation of it isn't even picking up. Oh. Oh, crap, people are dying. Oh. Oh, what the hell is that thing? I never found out. It looks like a... It's a rat mutation, but... Oh. Get, get your hands off my woman, bitch. I'm gonna beat your ass. Oh, no, he bit her. Oh. <sighs> I'm going to rape his ass. Uh, how the hell did I put on my suit that quickly? Was I walking around with it? Hey, everybody, look at my costume. I look so cute. <laughs> All right, Gwen. All right, we're in the gameplay now. Oh, shit, here we go. I gotcha. I gotcha. Okay. Well, let's, let's go back to what I was talking about, the Avengers. Actually, I think I'm all done. I think Marvel just had to plan all right. They know what we want, maybe. Maybe they know. We'll never know until we ask them. Hey, Marvel, what'd you think of the Avengers? Oh, we like lots of money. Wait for Avengers 4 to come out. What, are you expecting it to make as much money? We're like James Cameron. We're going to make four avatars, even though we only made one. <laughs> we know what you want. Give us some money. I, I have to talk about the avatar thing, too. I can't believe he's doing four avatars. Like, 
because it's the highest grossing film of all time, do you think we want to see it four times? Is it going to be the same fucking story again and again and again? Even though it's the same fucking story we've heard before about prejudice and all that shit. Not to say that it's a bad story, but tell it differently. Like, seriously, Avatar was not that good of a movie. Like, seriously, special effects, I fucking rate out of 10 out of 10. 11 out of 10, in fact, for graphics and all that shit. But story-wise was shit. Um, Acting-wise was shit. Uh, direction was kind of shitty. Oh, shit, spider walkers. Ah, run right away. Let's fucking Spider-Man attack. Boom. I like the spider sense above his head when he sees that. Imagine if James Cameron directed the next Spider-Man. <laughs> we have... <laughs> That'd be kind of weird, wouldn't it? Like, think about it. How does Avatar... Avatar works in a weird direction. But... Spider-Man with James Cameron would be totally fucking weird. <laughs> like, okay. Pew, pew. He'd probably make it like Spider-Man is on the screen every five minutes, and then they have to CGI, like, five extra suits on the same screen. But, oh, shit. There they go. See ya. <laughs> Thanks, Oscorp. <laughs> Thanks for being the sponsor of this game. <laughs> And someone was telling me as on my review, I was compl I was talking about the web shooters a little bit, and how I was talking about them, how they were made. Someone told me that Peter stole them from Oscorp. Now, when the was there a scene that shown Peter stealing from Oscorp? And I don't think Peter's a criminal. I don't know why the hell he would do that because he's trying to fight crime. I don't know why he'd become a criminal. <laughs> Turn yourself in, Peter Parker. Have Spider-Man costume just lay outside. Be like, I found him. Here's my costume. Stop it. Again, web shooters, amazing. I'm so fucking happy they added that in. Oh, excuse me. I kind of have the swallowing problem again. <laughs> like, I never thought the idea that Sam Raimi did in the original movies was bad with him just being mutated like that. But the web shooter idea was just g g not genius, because, you know, it's genius. It's never been done before. It's not in the comics, okay? But... They have had it in the comics too, where he's like Tobey Maguire Spider Man, where it comes from his veins. But I prefer web shooters because it, it makes more sense rather than having it squirt out of his veins. Oh, <laughs> I love these air conditioner ones. Like Spider Man turning, is it turning into Dead Space? Yeah, it is. Dead Space Two, climbing in air vents the whole game. <laughs> Which speaking of, I've lo. I don't know why Dead Space 2 got so critically acclaimed as not one of the best games of last year. <laughs> it should have been in, like, the top 10. In mine, if I had a, a list out, I probably would have put it in the top 10. But then again, I just started playing it. So it's completely unfair that I can say something after a year it's been out or so. The game came out in 2010. Yeah. In Dead Space 3, I am... It's not to say that I'm disappointed with it. It's just that I'm not looking forward to it for various reasons. I don't know. I think they need to work on it a little bit more than what it's going on right now. But you never know what's going to happen. You never know when uh <laughs> when it might be delayed till 2013. It's coming out in 2013. 2014. Make it a two years, okay? Like, I can understand that. <laughs> Wait, no, don't do the, it's not doing the Call of Duty thing, because Call of Duty ever comes out every freaking year, and it makes so much money, because it's the same game that everyone likes to play. Let's just get a new rendition of it. <coughs> Excuse me, I have to burp towards Gwen Stacy. Oh no, let's put her on the chair, let's get her some medical attack. Oh my god, Gwen, no, you've been bitten. Oh wait, I, we already know that she's been bitten, but oh no, Ben, Ben. Uncle Ben, no, you've been bitten by a spider, and you've gained spider powers, and your nephew Peter was shot because he was trying to find you, and you stole chocolate milk. <laughs> oh, wait, spoiler alert, Peter Parker steals chocolate milk. <gasps> oh, no! <laughs> I don't know why the fuck I brought that up. But, oh yeah, conversation. Yeah, that's what the subtitles are for. Thank you, subtitles. I hate games without subtitles. Like, when I bought RE4, 
which if you don't know what that is, that's Resident Evil 4 for all you idiots out there. But when I bought Resident Evil 4 on the Xbox Live Marketplace when it came out, oh, excuse me, it doesn't, it doesn't have self-titles, which I got really pissed off about because when I fucking get this thing to work, because I only get some games to fucking upload on here, Resident Evil, no, my computer doesn't like it. And so, let's not upload, you sucker. Ha 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 ha. That game is so good, but I wish it had subtitles because then I fucking post it up here and then you guys be like, oh, I know what's going on because then I would have been talking the whole time and been like, fuck you. I'm not turning up the sound. I don't want to turn up the sound because I don't know. I've been working with this program that I have that makes this stuff, but oh, let's upgrade our attack damage. <laughs> but the program I work with for a hey, equation 17 hours after incident. Oh. Psychiatric incident. Hey, lizard, how's it doing? I don't know why he's working on an equation. Is he? I never understood that. Like at the end of the movie, oh, spoiler alert. Turn down your mic for uh, I don't know until the end of the scene. I'm gonna try to hurry it up, but pause it or mute it quickly now. Okay, at the end of the movie, he gets locked up in jail. I don't remember him going to a psychiatric court. Okay, uh, hopefully you turn on your mics now. And I explained the spoiler if you have not seen the movie, but then again, you should see the movie. Oh, yeah. Open world. New Manhattan open world is so much fun in this game. It's not even a joke. Like, if you guys like Spider-Man 2, oh, my God, you're going to love the free roam in this game. <laughs> no joke about it. <laughs> I just love this game's open roam because when, you when you're just flying around, it's just like, I don't know. This this video is about twenty minutes long or so. No, I could talk. I've been talking about twenty minutes. Oh, here we go. Oh shit. Oh shit. What? Hi, Gwen. <laughs> uh, I hope you all like the smell of my voice through the microphone, even though I don't think you guys could hear it. <sniffs> wee wee wee. I'm a Spider Man. Spider-Man! Oh, Spider-Man. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, here we go. This is, this is a fun fight. <laughs> this is gonna... Th you guys are gonna enjoy this, because this... I'm just gonna say, you'll know, what, you'll know what this is if you've seen the Spike TV Awards from last year for 2011. Which, the Spike TV Awards are shit! <laughs> Not trying to be mean. Like, they put on a quality production, but... A couple years ago, we make Madden Game of the Year. <laughs> How does that work? Oh, here we go. I'm trying to remember if this is Central Park. No, Central Park is so much bigger. Oh, oh here. Oh, my God. What the fuck is that thing? <laughs> I never... It looks like a mutant, but it's not the lizard. Oh, shit. Here we go. Oh, Spider-Man. I got you, bitch. Watch out for this police car. Oh. <sighs> Yes, bro. Oh. Oh, here we go. Oh, my God. What is it? Oh, shit. It's a fucking... <laughs> it's from Raiders of the Lost Ark. They opened the... They opened the... The Raider... They, oh, they opened the Ark, I mean. Not the Raider. Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, it's a giant spider machine. S... Is that S... Okay? I didn't, I didn't read it. S-G-K. I don't know. S-S-S. How about that? Okay, so... I like this boss fight, it, even though we're probably going to have to fight this a couple times during the game, like these spider walkers. Oh, <laughs> again, uh, another thing that I liked in this game is that they added that interpretation that you can zoom into Spider-Man's mind, basically, like his his face, and see what he's seeing, and then quickly go in that direction, in whatever direction you want. Yeah, like that. <laughs> and just ease, it, it makes the game a little bit easier for a lot of people. It will help, definitely. It's one of the easiest tools to get through the game. But sometimes you can't rely on it. I'm just going to tell you that right now. It sometimes you'll get stuck in between two walls and you want to go higher. And then you'll slowly go down and you can't reach what you want to reach. I don't know why sometimes that's like, oh my god, am I going to get shot? <laughs> Stupid Xbox. Oh, <laughs> he was, he was going to eat me right there. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of this boss fight is swinging around trying to avoid beams, but, dude, that's fun. Oh, shit. 
<laughs> I need I need to watch where I'm going. I remember he got hit, but I don't remember when. Stop it, Xbox. I know you're online, person. Ugh. See, look, I couldn't figure anything out right there. So I had to just jump down. Oh, shit. <laughs> Swing! Swing! Go up. That's... Never mind. <laughs> I should start doing these captures more when I actually start filming with the game. When I play the game, I should just film with the capture, like, seriously. Like, comments with the capture going on. But then again, this program that I'm using, I need to work on... Oh, beat the fuck out of the missile. Uh oh, this. Beat the fuck out of the... Oh, I beat it to the dodge. Ha ha. Yeah, but this boss fight shouldn't take you that long. Like, I think it has a couple more minutes left for me. <laughs> Spider-Man, Spider-Man, it's whatever a spider game. And if I had to rate, I'm just gonna—I don't know why. I'm bringing up the old Spider-Man movies, but if I had to rate the originals, like the same review ones, Spider-Man one, probably like. No, the thing is about them—they're really stupid.